I'm Dr. LaJoyce Brookshire, a classical naturopath in the Pocono Mountains. I'm the best-selling author of Ask the Good Doctor. Today we're going to talk about herbs to kill a sore throat. Sore throats are pretty common during the winter months, but we are susceptible to them if we have a weakened immune system at any time. Some of the things that we have handy in our kitchen are, of course, salt. I prefer sea salt, and we could do it the good old-fashioned some warm water and gargle it all up and spit out the remains. That is an excellent way to help combat a sore throat, however temporary. Um, another way is to do the same thing uh, with a gargle with peroxide. Peroxide is also a temporary fix, but it certainly helps to soothe immediately if it's really, really paining, especially for a child. The other th herbs that I like to use best are garlic, ginger, habanero peppers, white onions, and horseradish. Now I know you might be saying these are so incredibly hot. Oh my gosh, how do I take them? We take them and mix them. And I've created with it a formula called the it's not just my creation. It's something that's been around since the beginning of time, I guess, in terms of holistic healers. But I have bottled it and found a way to increasingly perfect it and mix it with apple cider vinegar so that it has a nice shelf life. And the longer you let it sit around, the stronger it gets. And I'm telling you, if you have a sore throat or any kind of uh, first sign warning of the flu or cold or any little icky troubling you, if you take a shot glass of the anti-plague formula, whatever was bothering you at night won't bother you by morning. That's a guarantee. I also like to teach people how to make it because a naturopathic doctor is above all else a teacher. It is very important to learn how to care for yourself so that you and your village can remain whole. You got to get those immune systems up though. The immune system is very important. The throat and the tonsils are the first line of defense for infections that are trying to enter the body. So don't ever let anyone talk you out of taking out your tonsils. Don't ever let anyone talk you out of getting rid of your adenoids because those are the first lines of defense. That helps to make up your immune system. What we need to do if you're constantly fighting off an inflamed throat Get off of dairy products, get off of sweets, get off of artificial colors, and you will see a complete turnaround in the total health of your throat. Often uh, really susceptible to that, and it also accompanies a lot of times ear infections. But if you would take a good multivitamin, one with um, like that contains the superfoods, wheatgrass, spirulina, blue-green algae, barley, chlorella, chlorophyll, something like those in powder form for the kids, chewable, or in capsules. That is so good to help keep the immune system strong, to help ward off a cold. You do not want to have a sore throat every time the wind blows your way. So you've got to arm up, you've got to stay strong, you've got to put on the whole armor, as it says in the Bible, put on the whole armor of God, but also put on the whole armor so you can stay in perfect health. And join me for more on this topic at askthegooddoctor.org.